Hi guys, I'm here today to do a review video for the Born Pretty Store um, number 10 acrylic brush. It looks like this. Okay, if I can, oops, hold it correctly. Um, it looks like this, and it comes with this really neat um, cover here. Okay, and it is a little metal cover. Um, it The brush is a little worn because I've been playing with it a little bit to try and get a good feel for it so that I can tell you guys everything I think about it. Um, this was uh, not purchased by me. I did not spend any money on this brush. They sent it to me to review for you guys. Um, so uh, I did not purchase this. It was sent to me by the company uh, to review and I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to play with it for you guys so that you guys can see how well it works. Um, I'm actually quite impressed with this brush. Uh, it's, it's a fairly inexpensive, I believe it's under $20 for this brush. Um, and it, it is a flat oval brush, which I really, really enjoy. Like I enjoy using those type of brushes. So I just threw together a finger here. I shoved a fake nail on top of this finger and I'm going to go ahead and, and show you guys how uh, how well it works and how I like it. So let's get started. I'm just using some Diva DC colors. This is white that I'm going to be putting on the tip. And it holds quite a bit of liquid, um, more so than uh, my, my normal brush, but it does, it forms the bead really well. I really do like this brush. It's comfortable to use. Um, you can definitely etch out a shape with it. And it always comes back to a point, which it, for me is really, really important. I like when a brush uh, comes back to a point. Um, I feel like... Uh, it's important for a brush to do that. Hopefully I'm um, in the screen here for you guys. I'm just messing around. It's not my best work. I haven't played with acrylic in, in a while because uh, I've been sick. But... I really like the feel of this brush. It's a really good brush for the price. Um, I'm impressed. I like it. If you guys are interested um, in purchasing this brush, I'm going to link the website down below for the Born Pretty store. And um, I also have a coupon that the company was nice enough to give me. Uh, to share with you guys. So there is a $10 coupon or 10% coupon. Sorry, not $10. A 10% off coupon. Not the prettiest work in the world. Sorry, guys. But the brush cleans up really well. And if you look at it, it does come back to a point, which I really like. I'm going to go ahead and just throw some clear on there. I'm not going to do this whole nail because I feel like you guys get the point um, of the video. Um, I just want to say a quick thank you to Born Pretty Store also uh, for letting me review your products. Um, I definitely do like this brush and I like doing reviews. I think it's good for um it's good for us to uh share the good products out there. Get a good idea of what is good and what isn't. But there we have it. Just a quick a quick um review of this brush. Uh, I like it a lot. It's easy to manipulate and control. And I hope you guys have enjoyed this little review. Um, again, it's Born Pretty Store. This is a number 10 brush, which is a fairly large brush. Okay. And it cleans up really well.
it's very easy to clean and and handle it holds quite a bit of liquid which is important I think it's good to have a brush that can handle a lot of liquid um, there's been no fraying of the of the bristles or anything it is a sable hair brush um, the link that I found to it is called detachable luxury nail art acrylic UV gel sable brush um, and I believe the cost is 1922 but um, you would get 10% off of your purchase so that's really really good I believe it brings it down to like 17 and change um, so you guys be sure to check them out down below. I'm going to have the link. Thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you guys soon.